What's up everyone, Drew here. Today we have a case review for you guys, and this one's on the God case. And you guys can find this at glidecases.com. I will have a link down below in the video description for you guys. This is an aluminum bumper case for the iPhone 4 and the 4S. So right here we have the actual packaging, as you guys can see. We have case list right there for the iPhone 4S and Verizon. Taking a closer look on the side here, you have case list, and then you have God on the back. You got more instructions about the company and the case itself. So let's go ahead and simply pull this on out of its packaging here. Pretty simple packaging. Let's just slide this on out. Here we have the case itself in blue. They have many other colors over there at GlideCases.com. So basically this is a aluminum style bumper case for the 4 and the 4S. So there is the top part and then here we have our instruction manual. Kind of like a knockoff of the fake iPhone 4 or 4S. So there you go. So here we have the instructions. Pretty much tells you all of the parts. Etc. You got your welcome guide, your parts, and steps, and pretty much everything you need to assemble your case, which is obviously what I'm going to be showing you guys today. So we'll just set that off to the side. Now these parts actually snap off all four of them, but I'm not actually going to do that. I'm just going to go ahead and simply pop this in, and just like this, you're going to go ahead and simply start off with the left side here of your volumes, then simply snap it over, and then simply work your way on through just make sure everything does stay in place because it is easier when these are together so the next step is what you're going to go ahead and do is take your frame your front frame and simply align it to the top so just go ahead and simply do this just like that now this case does not play well with screen shields so you may have to lose your screen shields when you're purchasing this case as well as applying this case so do keep that in mind so after you have had this all snapped in as you guys can see this looks pretty slick on the white iPhone 4 or the 4S. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at it here. So taking a closer look here on the side, as you guys can see, we do have full access to the volume up and down button as well as the vibrate switch. No problems there of getting your hand in or anything like that. You should be a-okay, nice tactile feel. Come on to the bottom, we do have full access to the 30-pin speaker mic. No problems there with any third-party cables or etc. Come on inside, we do have nothing, so you will actually have to take the case off to access your SIM tray. Come up to the top, we have a very nice wide cutout for the power no problems there nice tactile feel as well as your headphone jack and mic come up to the screen we have a very nice lay on the table design as you guys can see we have access to everything your home button as well as your facetime camera and mic as well as your sensor no problems there come on to the back we do have full access to the camera and flash there's no problems with flash just because this is a bumper style case we have a nice look at the apple logo serial numbers etc so this feels great in the hand. There's no problems there with sliding out or anything like that. That's nice grip. So if you guys wanted to lay this on the table, there's no problems there with any scratching your device because again, it does have a nice lay on the table design. It feels great in the pocket and etc. So this is a very simple case. Now I have noticed some signal strength issues with this case. So as you guys can see, we do have full bars right now, but if I'm at work or something, the actual bars go down just because this is aluminum. Just do keep that in mind. And as you guys can see, you want to make sure you actually have the whole entire case snapped down before you go without your day because this will pop off if you don't have it all the way snapped down. But other than that, guys, it's a great case to have. You guys can find this at GlideCases.com. Thanks to GlideCases for sending this on out to us free of charge for review. I definitely do appreciate it. So definitely make sure you guys head on over there and check them out. So this has been Drew. Check out the Glide case. And you guys can find this at glidecases.com. Once again, if you guys like this video, get to make sure to subscribe right up there. Give this video a thumbs up. Drop all of your comments down below. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter. All of those links are down below in the video description. Until next video, guys, we'll see you guys in the next one.